Destiny waits for no man, Charles. Decide now whether this ends in salvation or blood. I choose annihilation. The end of all cycles. Let everything die. I accept my fate. Unlike the cowards who came before me. My hidden daughter. I am coming. I have made my choice. I willingly sacrifice myself like every seed before me. What is one life worth against all of humankind? Let the cycle restart. Break the cycle and free all of us trapped in Oakmont. Enough is enough. I'm leaving this damn city and its madness behind.
A visitor. Though you are a bit pale, you don't have a headache, do you? The usual. Nothing to write home about. Ah, a chronic headache sufferer. <laughs> Fascinating. Uh, by coincidence, I was studying Helminth and their role in illness uh, before the flood. Uh, did you know that all of us are infected by Helminth? Your, your headaches could indicate that they have infested your brain. That's news to me, Doc. Sounds serious. Hmm. May I suggest you become a subject in my experimental medical program? Experimental medicine. Well, I guess it can't be any worse than the asylum in Boston. Count me in. Uh, I'm delighted to hear that, Mr... Um... Uh, Reed. Charles Reed. Mr. Reed, take these pills with some water. They're a potent measure against parasites. Contact me when you feel improvement. What the hell did you give me, Doc? Is something wrong? You seem perfectly healthy to me. Your medicine blinded me. And then he gave me these visions. Worse than a blow to the head. What are you trying to pull? Intriguing. These side effects are a new development. I'll have to run some more tests. Let me know if anything else happens, won't you? Like what you see, buddy? Hammond back into his own body. Don't judge me. This, this may seem unnatural, but, but, but we will be together. Everything is ready. I'm sure it will work. I only need to break the mirror to release him. I can't go back empty-handed. And I won't leave without my son. Okay. Well. I guess you've got the right to try. Go ahead. I'll have to find some way to sweet-talk Robert. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you so much. Life can be cruel. Cool. 